When I arrived at the college, I inherited uh, a legacy research machine uh, network that uh, had been here for uh, about eight to ten years um, and was really not fit for purpose. There was no I uh, IT strategy in place and in real terms the college was about ten years behind the rest of the industry. Um, the main drivers for really creating a strategy and rolling the strategy um, out was to become a 21st century college ensuring technology is at the heart of everything we do. One of the elements of our strategy is to ensure that we create an environment that learners recognise from, from their, their, normal, uh, their normal life. So it's access to Facebook, it's um, creating a technology rich environment where we can use modern technology to, 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 to support our learners as they develop and as they educate themselves. I'm the communications officer for the student leadership team and my role is to look at the IT side of it the communications and how students use and understand the software we use in college. We've been working with um, a partner local to the college called Salford Software uh, to look at identity management. It's now really at the heart of everything we do in terms of interfacing with our applications. Uh, so much so that when a student comes to enrol here at the college, from the moment they, they actually uh, enrol, it takes 60 seconds uh, for a network account to be created for them um, and actually create an account on another new product that uh, we've been working with Salford Software on, which is Microsoft Live at Edu. Um, I think that Live at Edu is a revolutionary product. Um, it provides students with a Microsoft Live uh, email account, providing them with uh, 10 gigs of storage, something um, you know, we couldn't afford to provide our students. Um, it gives them a SkyDrive where they can save Microsoft uh, documents um, to the tune of 25 gigs worth of storage. Again, something that we, can't, um, we, we couldn't provide here at the college due to cost. Um, but they can save their, their Word documents directly from one of our virtual PCs up to their Live account. Um, or they can access them from home using the Microsoft Online um, Office uh, applications. Uh, one of the key elements of the college's strategic plan is to use technology as part of uh, our, our, our delivery mechanism, but also as part of smart business solutions. We've got a clear vision of how we see technology both influencing and assisting in our curriculum delivery. And it's about putting technology uh, at the core of all that we do, both in terms of our business systems, but also in terms of our, our educational response. We've come up with a concept uh, here at Hopper Hall College, which is called the Classroom of the Future. And this is about providing uh, e-learning, ILT technologies into the classroom. Like the new Life at Edu email office and personal storage space. Um, futures with uh, Salford as well, we're looking at rolling out uh, SharePoint 2010 um, and again this will be rolled out across uh, to our students and staff. The future of Artwood Hall uh, is a good question uh, to ask. Um, hopefully uh, a lot of improvements will be made within Rochdale to update the status of it because at the moment it looks generally alright but it looks close from the outside especially next to the new sixth form. But um, hopefully within the next few years things get improved and the general life of the college will live on. Uh, learners are, are highly adaptive to technology and they are making great demands on institutions such as ours. So part of our vision is ensuring that we've got a 21st century network, a 21st century techno technological response. We've got 21st century IT skills amongst our staff and indeed our students. And it's part of the brand of the college that the college is and you know, seen as the most advanced, most technically advanced college perhaps in the country.